And that is this game. So I can, because you know, I don't think I'm going to have a good excuse to play this later. Oh god. That's loud. I hope that isn't terribly ear hurting. I might as well look for the... So this is another game. Uh, it came from a website called VG Person, who you may know as they are the ones that translated. Uh, yeah, translated such amazing RPG Maker games as Ib, The Witch's House, Mad Father, The Crooked Man, Paranoiac, Mermaid Swamp, and The Sandman. But you know, in the not so boring games. He translated another game, which I'll try to get in the window now. Oops, no, not that. But this, I think, yeah. Game called It's Our Revolution. It's about the proletariat, so Steve should enjoy this. If he's still around. So, let me see if I can get the game started. So, what's the, the uh, premise of this game? Well, here's a monarch, a filthy monarch, such as a good communist should always hate. So, the youth says, we've come from the town, but they will not be able to meet the land tax. But the king doesn't want to reduce it. He wants higher taxes. Which is absurd, because the people will starve if this keeps up. But the king doesn't want to change his opinion. And we are thrown out. But he didn't listen. Well, maybe I should have come alone. If we gather a lot of people and try again, the king should listen. Yep. When you talk to the king, the game ends. But some of the people in town will not join us. And here's the gimmick of the game. It's basically a game of snake, because you can't walk uh, into the line of people that are following you. And you can get a lot of people following you at the same time. So there's that. So if you talk to these soldiers here, for example, they don't want to join the party. They don't want to join the revolution because they are comfortable with the evil monarchist regime. But if we go into the town, we can talk to this old man, who will join our party, as well as this little boy. Oops. Okay. Thought it was somehow lagging for a second there. And we can keep building our party, but here's the thing you see. If you try to walk to the left here, you won't be able to do it because you, the people that are following you are in your way. But let's not let that deter us. Let's gather as many people as we can and go visit the king. Oh, but this guy doesn't want to join the party. Or this guy. Because they have their own profession, sir. I, I bet I'll find a lot of willing people in the church, though. Like this nun, this middle-aged woman, and this old folk, this young people. The youth movement is sure taking off. Oh god, what did we you say this time? Uneducated people. Well, that's not wrong, I suppose. Oh shit, I think we're stuck. Unless this person moves, as she did. Yeah, if you, if you get stuck, you're gonna have to dismiss people from your party, and that's not fun. Because they all go back to where they originally were. So, you know, this seems like we've managed to gather a fair amount of people here. We have 23 people in our party. Oh, and there was that woman, but I think we're gonna be able to get her now. Unless we go all around the block. Yeah, there we have it. 
and head to the king's castle to demand that he lower the tax. But let's gather a few more people along the way. Because why not? We can do that. Scholar doesn't want to join us, or the witch. But I bet this guy near the trees will join us. Yeah, he will. So we managed to gather 30 people. So let's see if the king will change his opinion now. We can't back down, but for how many we have gathered, perhaps he will give it thought. But we shouldn't get our hopes up. So we gathered 30 people, but we can get more than that, so... Why don't we try that one more time? I wish there was a way to skip this, but there isn't. Blah blah blah. Yes, nothing the king ever says is interesting. That's how monarchs work. So now what? Yes, I know how the game mechanics work. So this time let's not bother recruiting anyone. And let's instead have a look around the game world. Uh, let's go back to the castle and explore a little more. See what we can do when we don't have a line of people hindering us. Doesn't seem to be anything outside. <laughs> yeah, clearly. You know, changing the tax rate is such a, a historical landmark for whatever kingdom this is. So there's just a bunch of people and I don't think any of them want to join us because they're all employed by the monarchy, but there is this. We got a guild guide and now we can enlist guild members. So we got, you know, the labor advocates on our side. And why do I have the feeling there's more like that? Well, Urotsuki, you're going to get your wish after this is done. Probably. But let's not spoil that just yet. Next, let's go to the town. Since I don't think we can do anything else at the castle. Oh boy. So we got our magic shop here, I think. Don't think we can recruit people in there. Got an item shop or a supply shop, not quite sure which. Got a weapon shop. And an armor shop. And an inn. Hmm. But we can leave this town as well. Maybe go to the smaller town here. That's not right at the foot of the castle. See if there's anything interesting in here. Well, there's a chest in the corner here. Uh, oh god. This person won't join the party and won't let me pass. That's great. Oh, but this guy will. I guess now we wait for this person to get out of the way. Yeah, there we go. And that's how we get the chef guide. And now we need to get out of here. Please move. <laughs> now that we can recruit chefs, which you know is quite a large group apparently for people that... Exercise one profession only. Let's have another look around the town. Without recruiting anyone because we're just exploring. Hmm. We can invade these people's homes, but I don't think we can find much here. Unless we do. We got a pink slip. Apparently we can get unlimited pink slips from that chest. Hmm. 
Not quite certain what else there is to do in this town, though. Maybe check out the church. Nothing too interesting around here, it looks like. Maybe here to the west, where the dockside area is? Nothing. Bunch of sailors here who will not join us. A captain who will not join us. Well, yeah, that seems to be a customary arrangement. Liquor and housing right next to one another. Traveler's friend. So not that much to do in the town. Maybe if we explore the pub. So apparently the bunny girl will join us, even though... Oh, but we dismissed her. I'm not sure what... Well, I guess they are, like, right at the bottom rung of the labor chain. So they would have quite a bit to gain from low taxes. Jesus. So apparently not much to see in the old town. The ordinary town. Except that right there. There's a chest in the corner. Which contains this color guide. So now we have the chef guide, the guild guide, and the scholar guide. Meaning we can enlist people from all those three professions, but it's not quite... We're not quite ready to embark on our quest yet. First, let's visit the mountain village. Hmm, there should be an elder's house not far from here. Right here. Yeah, at the top of this mountain, the Elder's House clearly the uh, best place in town, even though we're not going to recruit him yet. And here's another chest with the Merchant Guide. So now we can enlist the Enlist Merchants as well as other professions. So let's gather up as many people as we can, and... Which shouldn't, still shouldn't be that much, I don't think. See if we can't get them to help us with something. Get as many able-bodied men as possible. Old men, little girls, anyone who will join us. Who will join the revolutionary effort. Luckily, the snake line thing doesn't carry over into the map. Uh, if we go back here, I think we can get another hidden town, which is actually the market town. We can get a lot more people in here, including merchants, because we have the merchant guide now. That is something that we have. So, you know, time for a while of people gathering. Apparently that maid won't join us, which is kind of weird. You'd think he made, which is a rather underpaid job, I would assume. Would want the taxes to be lowered. Oops. So let's gather up all the people we can manage to get to follow us. The clown will join us, luckily. Bingo will do us that favor. Oh shoot, might have messed up. Yeah, I think I've messed up. Bollocks. So let's use our pink slips. Or not. Let's just dismiss everyone. So we shouldn't have gone in there, but that is easily remedied. Let's just go back and gather up these people all over again. Not the mountain ones though, they can stay there. Because I'm not going back. And let's not go into that closed garden there, but rather encircle the... ...the plaza. 
Uh, we have 20 people with us. Wonder if that's enough. I really do wonder if that's the case. I'm going to assume that it is. Because I don't really feel like gathering more. Oh shit, get out of our way, don't tell me that. Uh, God. Well, looks like this guy's gonna get dismissed. There we are. Didn't mess that up this time. And let's go back to the the castle town, because there's something we should do there. We need to do. Let's gather up more people. We have little girls and men and merchants in our party. Uh, and I think we'll be able to gather up a bunch of people at the church. Since apparently everyone there is not happy with the taxes. So we go up these, these stairs. Hope we have enough room to get back out. I think the preacher will join us. Yes, he will. Okay, there we go. So I think that's going to be enough for what we want to do. We got nearly 50 people in our party. But we're still going to keep gathering them because we're going to need numbers where we're going. Why not? You come, you come. And you as well. Apparently the screen's having trouble rendering all this and let's save. Because we might mess this up still. Uh, get stuck. If you go underground here, we will find the dungeons. There's no entry, but we're going to use force. That's why we got all these people. We're going to beat on these two soldiers. Don't really get to choose how this goes. But luckily the soldiers aren't that mighty of two enemies. I just hope we don't run out of people before they faint. That would be unfortunate. Notice how each person actually has its own set of attacks. Okay, got one of them and we're not even 10 people down I think. So this should be fairly easy. So we lost some people, but we knocked out that soldier. And the reason we did this was to rescue the Kit Kat here. Because now that Kit joined the party, we can open doors. And, uh, you know, we're not gonna leave this many people for a while, so let's just tell them to fuck off. But yeah, we can open doors now. That's quite a useful skill. Well, you know, they committed a mass crime by storming the castle and freeing a prisoner of war or something, so that's quite insurrective. So what shall we do now? Also, what are people saying on Skype? Okay. Well, we need doors. We need more guides now. The ones that we need to open doors to get. Uh, so where are they? Where are they? So apparently they're in the castle town. Let's check out the inn. Yes, we can open doors now. We can come into these people's rooms now. But I don't think any of them have the uh, chest we're looking for. But that room does. So let's get the craftsman guide. And let's hunt um let's hunt our next guide down. Should be somewhere around here. Probably in an unlabeled house. 
much like that one. Oh, but it's not in here. It's just a house that had its door closed. One of these will be it, though. Ah, uh, just fuck. Ah, uh, fuck it, you get it on my way. Oh, I have the pink slip. Right. Probably should, uh... Ah, uh, fuck it, I'll just leave it on. Oh, we got a scholar, yes, because they will now join our party. And there's the thing we've been looking for. The... Servant guide. So apparently servants are in a whole other syndicate. Or a whole other group of workers. You know, the guild of servants. That sounds like a great concept. Has quite a nice ring to it. Uh, so we need to go back to the market house. The market town. And look for a big mansion. Maybe we'll be able to open these chests. No, we will not. Get out of my way. This should be the market mansion. Yes. Got some pink slips. Uh, oh, there's a chest right there. Behind this closed door. Got a sickle with which to cut small plants. Oh, I see. <laughs> Goodbye, Burn. Rest easy. Think shit's calmed down now. Oh yeah, we did lose the cat girl, but we still know how to open doors. Uh, so now that we've gotten that, it's time to gathering people. Time to go back to gathering people, because we're going to need quite a few of them for our next task. Luckily, a lot of them will... Uh, willingly join us now that we have all those guides. But we do need a lot of them. <laughs> so let's gather as many people as we can. I'm gonna have to save so I can make sure that we don't get stuck. Have to redo this all over again. Will you come with us? You will not. That's dirty noble. This person will not come either. Do we get the maids to come though? Let's get all the people in this house if we can. To accompany us on our journey to sway the king's opinion. Uh, be someone here, maids, yes maids. Proletariat masses. The butlers, the Servants. It's not quite what we're going to use these people for, though. It's not far off. Thank goodness we have the chef guide, I think. Does this person want to come? He does not. So we managed to score 25 people so far, but... See, this is why you save. Oh. Clown come with us as well this guy this guy will not however this guy will join us this guy will also join us this person will join us as will this person might as well save again never know when you're gonna get stuck have to restart this Uh, managed to get almost 50 people from this town. Luckily it'll be just as easy everywhere else. Oh god. Yeah, I think I got stuck there. Do I have the pink slips turned on? Yes, I do. Okay, that was a close one. Please come with us. Don't. Jesus fuck. Can we get 50 people before we leave the town? I think we can. Yes, we can. We got 51 people from that town. Unfortunately, we cannot recruit the dog yet. But we will give the... Uh, what was this place? I forget. Oh, we can't go in there. So let's get out of here. Should probably
probably save again, lest I get stuck. I think we're going to leave the castle town for last, since that's where we have to go. Check out the item shop. No, wait. We shan't check out the item shop. Can go back to the map and not do that this time. Uh, the wizard... The mage does want to come with us. That's kind of strange. Don't think we have the wizard guide yet. If there is such a thing. We are sure are getting these middle-aged and old people to join us though. Oh fuck. Jeez. Fortunately this is sort of full of bullshit like that. This is where you get stuck without being able to tell if you're going to. So let me see. So let's not go get that old lady now. She's not worth it. Let's get these little girls though. I'm sure they'll be mighty warriors. Will this person accompany us? They will. What about this guy? Yeah, he wants to come with us. I think the church is a good place to go. Yeah, there's always a lot of people in the church who want to join your efforts. As I'm sure is the case for a lot of modern churches, because why not? So we're almost at the number that we want to get, I think. Yeah, let's do this puzzle for the sake of getting this one guy to join us. How much longer do we have to stretch this? A bit longer, a bit longer. Come on. Ugh. Fuck it. Just gonna go. Just not gonna get the priest. Yeah, God hates taxes. His people should be the free people. Except for the irony that the Jews now have more money than everyone else combined. But let's not get into, you know, that. I hope both of these people will join me, and they will. Sure hope the line runs out before I reach the door. I certainly certainly hope okay did. Uh, this guy does want to join us. This guy, this person rather, does want to join us. So let us venture into the docks to hopefully get the last batch of People we need to recruit for our little quest, at least for the moment. I don't think the sailors will want to come with us, so this might have been a bad idea. Let's not go to the docks, let's stick to this area. We need only a few more people, really. This guy does want to come with us, this guy does want to come with us, this person too, and her. And him. And how did I miss this guy? Okay, let's go to the castle town to get the last batch of people. We need. Should be plenty there. Get this little boy, get this little girl, get the apprentice grappler. Uh, go this way first. The average man, the old woman. <laughs> average man. Oh dear. This mage? Yes. Only need three more. This girl, this dude, and I f oh. Uh, I forget the place where we have to go actually. Okay, we made it. We got a hundred people following us. Let's see if I can reach the place where we have to take them now. I think it's this building. And there we are. See, the people here are adventurers. We can hire all of them for a thousand gold each. But we, we have no money and we can get no money. So of course what we do is come here and speak to the guildmaster, Arnold, who is impressed with the enormous throng of people we, can, we have managed to get. So now we can enlist adventurers. Let's get rid of all these stupid people and get a bunch of adventurers following us. Geist, Hamilton, Hogan. 
Look, like how all the adventurers have their own individual names. So we have a giant war force being assembled here. Uh, try not to get ourselves trapped in this place, though. We're gonna be able to get all of them because I forgot that. To circle this place, you have to go through a door in the dude's office. Uh, let's hope that person in the corner walks towards us for a little bit. There we are. And now we have like 40 or 50 adventurers following us. So now that we do with this giant war force is go adventuring. I forget where we're supposed to go first. I think it's this place over here. <laughs> yes, there we go. So time for some real adventures. Let's enter this dungeon. <laughs> which is packed with slimes and goblins. If we touch a slime or a goblin, we will lose a party member, so let's not do that. And let's also try not to get stuck, because that can happen very easily. Fortunately though, I think these guys will follow us. Uh, which way from here? Uh, this way, if, yeah we can. Let's hope that those slimes get out of the way. Please move, there we go. Oh god. Not entirely certain whether this will work. Uh, need to get into that little... There we go. Just move it. Oh wait. Shoot, I messed up. It's not where we were supposed to go at all. We have to go down from here. I think... Yeah, this, this water hurts, hurts us, but... Not much we can do about that. I sure hope this slime moves. Thankfully, I don't think the slimes hate you, but the goblins do. Move. Thank you. So let's circle this goblin. And get to where the boss is hiding. Who is the boss of this first evil dungeon, you might ask? It's a cow. Let's challenge the cow to battle. See, that kind of looks rather different.